What's up you guys? It's Kaylee. So, today I am here. I don't have a special guest and I don't have Emma. Um, today's Father's Day so I just thought I would film a little video. Of course you guys aren't going to see this on Father's Day but happy Father's Day to everyone out there. And um, today I have a Japan crate that I got from the mall. Now it was really interesting because I I went to this game place, it was like a game store in the mall and they had these and um, I've never seen this kind of before, it's the Japan crate. I've seen like, you know, all the other anime crates and stuff and Japan crates, but I've never seen this one. So, um, Japan crate has paired or partnered with Fi or F-Y-E, I don't know, uh, to offer an exclusive crate full of the best Japan candy, snacks, and drinks you can only find in Japan. Inside, there's a total of 15 items, two pounds of candy, snacks, and a drink, a $10 gift voucher off future Japan Crate subscription, uh, a magazine with item description contest and manga, and bonus includes a mystery collectible uh, featuring one of the following, either Rakuma, Snoopy, or Pusheen, or I think there's another one but it's in Japanese, so I can't read it. <laughs> but um, I'll just show you guys. So uh, yeah, that's that. So without further ado, let's get started. I'm very excited. I also have some manga that I'm gonna show you that I got from Barnes & Noble. All right, let's open this up. Ooh, all right, this is fun. So on the inside, it looks like this. <laughs> so, um, I'm gonna start off, well, here's my little card, I'm not gonna show you guys because, like, it's got my code on it, but, yeah. So, first thing that's on top is, um, oh, it's Rakuma, and it's, like, this little, like, ducky towel. Oh, it's so cute. Sorry if you can hear noise in the background, that's my mom. Um, but it's this little Rakuma. And here's the tag. It's in Japan. Japan. It's in Japanese if you guys want to pause it and read it if anyone can read Jap Japanese. Sorry, I can't talk today. This is really cute. I like it. It's soft. It's like a bath towel, I think, or something. Oh, okay, so this is the little thing that has all of the item descriptions. We'll get to that next. Okay, wow. There's a lot. <laughs> There's a lot of food in here, and I don't know if I'm going to be able to get to all of it. So we'll start with this. So it looks like this. Um, I have no idea what it's called. Um, let's just open it, I guess. Interesting. Oh no, is it gonna be like shrimp flavored? Cause I don't like shrimp. I don't know. I've never tried. Cheers. Whoa. That's interesting. I think I like it. I think I like it. It's like, let me see if I can find what it is. So it's a puffy corn snack. So it's a, oh. Okay, so it's a tonkatsu, tonkatsu. I don't know, I'm not good at pronouncing things. Um, but basically what it is, is it's a deep fried pork chop, common in Japan. It's typically served with cabbage and sweet sauce. So it's basically like a, like a steak type of thing. It's really good actually. I'm gonna eat that later. <laughs> okay. Ooh, we, I see some Pocky. I'm gonna try this next. So it's like, this looks like Hello Kitty Pocky. I'm gonna close this. Okay, so it looks like we've got some Hello Kitty Pocky sticks. And I think they're strawberry, yeah. My mouth tastes like, it kind of tastes like a shrimp type of situation. I don't know. Okay, so, oh, this is cute, a little packaging. Okay, let's try it. These are so 
freaking good. Oh my god. Oh my god. These are so good. <laughs> wow. Okay. Let me read the thing. Hello Kitty strawberry pretzel. Um, similar to Pocky, um, these biscuits were hand dipped in delicious strawberry coating by Hello Kitty herself. Well, thanks Kitty. Um, these are really good. I actually highly recommend these. Um, they're really good. Here's the side of the box. It's all in Japanese, of course, but these are actually really good. I really do like those. Okay. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get to all of this. <laughs> There's a lot. Um, let's try this. This looks good. So this looks like a sour apple type of candy rope that I think... We have something similar to this in America. Um, like airheads or something. But let's try it. I'm going to have so much candy opened. Okay. I'm probably going to split this into two videos. I don't know. Okay. Okay, these are really good, <laughs> of course, but like, it's not sour. Like, the sour candies always say they're sour, but you know, they're really not. These are really freaking good, oh my god. Okay. Where is it? Okay, it's called... Two wing sour apple straws. All right. So those are good. Not super sour, because you know, sour sour candies never usually sour. But you know. Okay. I still have so much left, you guys. Like, oh my god. Let's try. I kind of want to try this soda. No, I don't want to try that quite yet. Let's try. So we did something sweet, let's do something salty. So I'm gonna try these. So this looks like a vegetable sun, sankura. Sorry, my phone just went off on me. Put that on vibrate. So this looks like some like vegetable type of chip. I don't know, let's see what it says. So they're vegetable crackers, yeah. It says these are good when you top them with cheese or ham. We'll try it. <gasps> oh, okay. Oh, they're so small. Okay, wait. So they come in like a little thing like this. You just grab one. They fell out. Alrighty. They're that big, so cheers. To be honest, I'm not a big fan. They don't really taste like anything. They're not bad, but they're okay. <laughs> so, I still have so much. Oh my god, <laughs> I'm overwhelmed. Okay, um, I think next. Hmm, how many do I have left? One, two, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I have ten more. One, two, three. Four. So I'll open one more because I'll do five in this video and five in the next video. So I'm gonna save this. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Um, so let's try something sweet. So let's try this. This looks interesting. So I'm gonna close the box for now. Once again, this is Japan Crate. You can get it on a subscription. This is not sponsored in any way. Let me just say that now. This video is not sponsored. Okay. So, well, let me show you this first. They got this big sticker on it. Okay, well that worked really well, didn't it? Um, well, there we go. Oh, no. My life is a lie. So that's what it looks like. I can't get all of the packaging off because they put this huge stupid sticker across it, but if I have any Japan viewers, which uh, if I do, um, 
Hi, greetings. <laughs> I, I really want to go to Japan, so if anyone could hook me up with that, that would be amazing. Anyways, um, so if anybody out there has tried this, let me know. Um, so let's look and see what this is. Uh, sour cider gum. Oh, so... Okay. So it's gum. Alright, so it's cider gum. So like apple cider or like... Whoa. That smells like bubble gum on like cracks. <laughs> Whoa, this is gum? It's like a really light mint color. What? <laughs> what is this? Um. Whoa. I've never had anything like this in my life. It's hollow, first of all. It's like, <laughs> I kind of like it though. Sorry, my phone keeps going off. I kind of like it, to be honest. Hmm. Okay, it's really weird. It's like sour. Oh, I almost dropped it. I don't know how I feel about it. I think I like it. Okay. Wait, hang on. Let me recount the items in here. Okay. I counted way wrong, guys. One, two, three, two, two. There's nine more. <laughs> I don't know how I miscounted, but I did. I accidentally just swallowed some of the gum. That's cool. Um. Ooh. Okay, wait. We'll try. We'll try one more, I guess. I want to try this. This looks cool. Oh, I have to make this. We'll save that for another video. For the other video. Um. Let's do. I want to wait on the soda. Let's do this one. This looks interesting. Okay, hang on. Okay. So next is this guy right here. So, this gum is actually really good. <laughs> but I have to take it out. <gasps> no! So this is double ice cream lollipop chocolate and vanilla. Chocolate and vanilla. Um, it's a lollipop flavored like ice cream. Um, so yeah. And there's a whole featured page dedicated to this. Um, here's this little book, by the way, volume 22. So if you fold it out all the way, that's what it looks like. It's a really cool picture. It's cool artwork design. Okay, so let's try this. And then this will be the last one. And um, I'll make a separate video uh, doing the rest of it. That smells so good. What do you mean? So here it is. Um, that doesn't really look like vanilla. It looks like caramel and chocolate, but I'm fine with it, so. This is so good. Oh my God. This is so good. This is, this is my favorite. I think by far, this has to be my favorite thing. So out of all the things I've tried today, I think my favorite is this chocolate and vanilla lollipop and these sour apple candy string things. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is really good. I'm gonna set it down for a second but I'm gonna finish you later. I'll see you here in a few minutes after this video, you know what I'm saying? So, um, by the way, I just wanna remind you guys, this is not sponsored by, um, you know, Japan Crate. If they want to sponsor me, hi, how are you? I'm in love with Japan. Um, I could show you my room, but like I can't right now, but I have Japan everything. Like I have Miku, Hatsune Miku. I have Sailor Moon, anime, everything. I have manga, I'm obsessed. 
And the only really Japan candy that I've ever had is Pocky, but I got it from Target. <laughs> so like trying this stuff is really, really cool. Um, it's really cool for me because I, I really want to go to Japan. Uh, this video is already 15 minutes long, so I'm going to stop talking. <laughs> so this next thing that I wanted to show you just as a little extra, this did not come with the Japan crate, but I just wanted to show you. So I got two new mangas um, and I got this one. So if you guys have ever heard of this, um, Konoshiba. Hey guys, it's me. So I'm editing this video and I'm cringing right now because I mispronounced the title of this book. So uh, it's Konosuba, not Konoshiba. So I uh, just thought I wanted to, you know, point that out because I'm cringy. So uh, yeah, love you guys. Uh, next week there should be a video of me and Emma up, hopefully. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna stop rambling now and I'm gonna go. All right, bye. It's supposed to be really good. Um, I have not read it myself, but you guys can pause that there, read it if you can. Um, yeah, but it's Konoshiba's God's blessing um, on this wonderful world, and uh, it seems really good. I've heard really good things about it. I think there's four books, question mark? I. I know there's at least three because I was gonna pick up the third one yesterday at Barnes & Noble but I decided not to <laughs> because I already have a whole set of Sailor Moon manga that I need to finish. I have one through six and I need to get seven through twelve. So seven through twelve, right? Yeah, question mark. Yeah, but um, I just thought I'd pick these up because I really wanted to get some new manga and um, I've heard good things about this so yeah. And I also really want to find the book Metamorphosis, the manga Metamorphosis. I've heard really good things about that one. It's kind of dark, um, so if you're not really into that kind of thing, I don't recommend that you get it. Um, but for those who don't know what manga is before I go, um, it's, well, <laughs> this is manga. So here's some of the artwork designs in it. It's so good, like it's, it's really good. And, um, you read it differently than a traditional book, like, you know. So, let me show you. So if we're in America, how I would read a book normally is I would start like this and go like this, right? I don't know if this is gonna be backwards, it probably is. But in Japan, you read it this way. So instead of reading left to right, you read from right to left. Does that make sense? Yes, no, maybe so. My phone is blowing up and it won't shut up. I'm trying to film. Um, but that's all I have for you guys today. Um, I hope you enjoyed. Me and Emma, we love you so much. Um, yeah, that's basically it. Um, I'm probably going to film the second part of this some other time. Um, I'm probably not gonna do it today because I am not very hungry right now. I just got back from brunch for Father's Day. We just got done eating, but I really wanted to sit down and make this video because I was really excited to see what Japan had in store for me. So um, I really do like this little towel. It's pretty cute. It's not very big, I'll show you, I'll stand up. It's like this big computer. Oh, that'd be a cute dress, right? Like, quack. <laughs> yeah, so, um, this is really cute. Don't know where I'm gonna put it. Don't know what I'm gonna do with it. I don't know, <laughs> because I could use it in my bathroom, I guess, but. Yeah, so, this video is already 19 minutes long. I'm gonna stop talking. I'm gonna go. I love you guys so much, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye.